Can you trust the version of you that you are attempting to save? Can you trust the version of you? Because I'm going to be real with you. The old version of trap, I couldn't trust it. We all working together to accomplish a common goal, which is freedom. That's the goal that we all about. So I want to help us shatter the myths that we can't accomplish freedom. I want us to shatter the myths that we don't have enough money. I want us to shatter the myths that we are incapable of building wealth. But what happens is if we got to all, some of us are Davids and some of us are Jonathans. We got to get people around us that's going to help us accomplish the vision. Some people are good at just being followers. And ain't nothing wrong with that because check this out. Mike had lost to the Celtics. Mike had lost to the Pippin. I mean, to the Pistons. But when he got Pippin, yo, it was a game changer. And Pippin still going on as one of the greatest players of all time. Why? Because he was a great number two. Some people are good at like, yo, just give me the vision. I'm going to knock it out of the park, bro. Just give me the vision. I'm going to knock it out of the park with you, queen. Just give me the vision. I'm going to do the details. I love Lashana. She is on my team. She gets on my nerves sometimes. But guess what? When I know the X's and the O's, she trying to protect me. She want to make sure we good. Yo, I can't take that away from her. I feel like the vision can get executed because I got a Lashana. And so I'm willing to nurture the relationship. I'm also willing to say, okay, we're going to move like this. Some of y'all, you get mad when the people around you ain't moving how you want to move. They don't supposed to move how you want to move. They supposed to move according to the vision. Are you ready for change? Are you ready for it? Are you ready to take yourself and your family to the next level. Because if you want to take your family to the next level, it's going to be more than just you. I wanted to take my family to another level. I had the vision. Cuz, come with me. I got my other cousin. She on a support team. I'm already putting my little cousins in play. They going to do some other stuff. Yo, you're my other cousin that's about to graduate college. You good with numbers? Yo, I need you to go to college and do this. I got you. I got a mentorship. I got an intern. All that's going to be waiting for you. You know why? Because I know you can help me help the people we can accomplish a vision together I'm good at being in the front I'm good at being a visionary y'all can help me execute but you know why they willing to be down not because I got the vision because they already see what I'm doing right now working and they saying yo how can I add value to that we got to infuse the vision with value and then infuse the value with people that can help us move the needle. Jordan would have never beat the Pistons or the Celtics by itself. He had to sell the people on the vision. He had to infuse hard work. He had to infuse dedication. He had to infuse resiliency. He had to infuse the mindset. They say, bro, in practice, Jordan and Kobe probably was the worst teammates ever. But on the court, they transformed. They just had belief like, yo, they going to get it done. Why you think people give Mike the ball? They know he going to get it done. Why they get Kobe? They got the confidence to get it done. Do you have the confidence and have you build the people up around you enough to say, yo, so-and-so going to get it done? I could give him the ball in the full quarter with a little time on the clock. I'm cool. I was listening to a clip on Instagram the other day. Ron Artest said, man, Kobe passed me the ball. He hit the game winner. He said, yo, Kobe don't never pass me the ball, but he passed me the ball. And because he passed me the ball in such a clutch time, I shot it with confidence. He said, I heard Phil saying, no, no, no. But Kobe passed me the ball, so I shot it with confidence because Kobe passed it to me. The confidence that he passed it to me with, I know this is a shot that Kobe will probably take, but he passed it to me and his confidence transferred to me. So I shot with confidence can you trust the version of you that you are attempting to save
can you trust the version of you? Because I'm going to be real with you. The old version of trap, I couldn't trust him. I had to let him go. Now, when I say let him go, I don't mean I got rid of him, but I had the tra- I had the metamorphosis. I had to grow into a new form and I had to take control and let him walk on side of me. I couldn't let that trap lead. I couldn't let free lead. He too emotional. He got issues he's dealing with and he don't want to deal with the issues. He, he rambunctious at times. He, be, he act off ego sometimes. I can't let him lead. But there's a few traits in him that I'm going to need as I'm on the journey. So I had to say, okay, trap, you're this, free as that. We're not going to get rid of him, but we're going to walk with him. But he can't lead. I ain't trust him in this situation. So what I'm telling you is the version of you that you're trying to hold on to, the version of you that you keep saying, this is just the way I am, the version that you keep saying, man, I'm built like this. Can you trust that version of you to the destination where you're going at? Like we the only one doing a live show with this much production. Like we bar none, we just different. We not in competition with nobody. To see somebody that looks like us talk about stocks because I had never seen that before. You know, we buy during the drought and a recession is the best time to buy. I feel a whole bunch of wealth up in here, y'all. Someone who gives me raw and uncut information. I know how to break down a company. I know how to invest. Being a more confident investor. That Wall Street does look like us, no cliche. I will no longer fertilize my fears. That financial trauma has to be broken. We got to understand that we are more than consumers. One share at a time can change your life. Change your life. What we doing? What we doing? We're printing money, baby. I think over the last couple years, um, just being in America has made everyone realize that there's no such thing as job security. It's time to take accountability. It's time to be responsible. It's time to make the sacrifices. It's time to put in the work because this time it done got worse because this time ain't no saving you. I need you to be real with yourself. I need you to be real with yourself. Transformation is the byproduct of new information. We are truly at the beginning of a generational shift. Those with the skill set, those with the mindset, those with the tool sets will transcend. Tool set is the ability to identify the tool that's needed in the present situation. So if I get in the right situation, I need to know whatever situation I'm in, I have the tool, I can identify the tool that's needed. Skill set, the ability to use the tool in the situation and execute. Mindset, the belief that I'm capable of doing it. I'll say it again. Say it again. We are truly at the brink of a generational shift. We at the brink of it. Like it's, it's we see it. Those with the skill sets, those with the mindset, and those with the tool sets is gonna transcend. Everybody else is gonna be left behind. If you don't transcend, you will be a walking form of residue of yesteryear. It, you will be the residue of the walking form of yesterday. Meaning, in 2035, you'll be saying what you did in 2023. You'll be saying what you had in 2020. You'll be saying what you were doing before the pandemic. You're going to have people saying, man, before the pandemic, I was. Man, before COVID messed up everything, I was. Before COVID, I did. Man, COVID messed up my life. COVID shifted my family. Okay, guess what? During COVID, after COVID, and right now, yo, we transcended. Will you be a part of that? Tool set. The ability to identify the proper tool in any given situation. Yo, the market is going a certain way. Am I doing calls? Am I doing cover calls? Am I doing puts? The market is down right now. Is I'm buying real estate? Am I leveraging? What am I doing? 
Do you have the tools, the mindset? Am I capable? I am capable of doing this. I'm not fertilizing my fears. I'm fertilizing the beliefs. I'm fertilizing my tomorrow. I'm putting myself in another trajectory. I know I am possible. I know I can do this. I ain't built for this. It's the fourth quarter. Give me the ball. It's the fourth quarter. I can pass it to Jose. Would I have the mindset and then the skill set? I got the tool and I know how to use it. I got the skills that I know how to use it. Bet the options, the game money, options called. Buy and hold. Will we? I, it don't matter. Every, every market is a bull market for me. I'm going to go find where to get some money at. It will be disastrous if we allow ourselves and our family and our, left, our next of kin to be left behind. It will be disastrous if we don't put our family on a boat like Noah. It is disastrous. And I'm going to keep it real with you. Sometimes you get blessed just for being with certain people. We rocking with Trap. He got the information. B said this the other day. Man, B said, man, my partner asked me, man, something B said. And B said, man, just being around Trap, I know I'm going to go get two million, at least two million. He said, why he said? He said, because I'm watching to make money every day. I'm going to be a fool to work here and not get the option class. I would be a fool to be here and not learn. I ain't just here to shoot. I'm here to learn. Sometimes you get blessed with just being in a certain situation. Yo, I see the work this dude put in. Every time he put the goddamn on thing, he making money. I at least need to say, hey, trap, plug me. Plug me. Plug me. We are now in a situation, yo, this is what the Rockefeller saw when he said, yo, oil, bet, I got it, oil, yep, that's what we doing. We are now with Mark Zuckerberg, saw what he said, yep, Facebook. We are now with Jeff Bezos said, yep, Amazon, I'ma sell books. We are now with Elon Musk first said, yo, Tesla, we gonna change the world with that. We are now here to take advantage to turn our wealth a hundredfold, but the problem is, you don't want to leave the past. You still trying to hold on to what you once were instead of looking at what will become. And if we don't change that, man, we're going to be in a bad situation. Nothing compares to the power of having wealth. And I'm not just talking money. I'm talking freedom. I'm talking time. I'm talking opportunity. I'm talking being able to be with your loved ones. I'm talking about that type of power. I'm not compared to that. And the only way you can restore something, people said, I want to restore what my people once had. You got to destroy, you got to demolish what you have. You got to destroy those pillars. You got to destroy that frame. You got to destroy that roof. You got to destroy that room so you can go in and rebuild it. So you can update the bathroom. So you can update the living room. So you can update the plumbing. So you can update the electricity. So you can update the database. You got to demolish it so you can restore it. That means putting this back in its right place and then some. That means getting back to what you was and then some. Abundance overflow significance and that's what Wall Street looks like uh, is all about that's what Trap and Tudors is all about that's what we come in for three hours every week that's what it's all about I ain't gonna lie to you I can't talk about what I want to talk about in an hour I can't dig deep enough in an hour that's why I couldn't rent nobody else space because they was gonna kick me out in an hour So I want y'all to know, man, I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Man, this tour is going to be crazy. We six weeks away, man. We six weeks away from the first show in ATL. We ain't got no celebrities. We just come to give you game. We come to equip you. Because right now, right now ain't the time for the celebrities. In my mind, they already got their millions. They already got their billions. I don't want to leave with a notebook full of celebrity millionaire quotes. 
I don't want to leave with motivational quotes and when I get home I realize, damn, it's a whole bunch of quotes but not enough execution. I can watch that on YouTube. So I give you my word, we're going to lead that with, we're going to lead that with game. We're going to lead that with uh-uh, trap, uh-uh, uh-uh, exit and O's, crossing T's and dotting I's. I promise you that. It's the first tool, but it ain't the last one. But I promise you, I'm going to set the tone with this one. I promise you, we going to set the tone with this one. Seven cities. Get your tickets. Let's go.